Well, tonight, one man is dead after being shot in Bentonville. We'll send you to the city now where 4029's Lydia Fielder is live. She's been following the news throughout the night. Hello, Lydia. Hey there, Brandon. Police say tonight they're working to figure out what led to a shooting here in this otherwise quiet apartment complex in Bentonville tonight that left one man dead and another in custody. Very shocking to hear that. Callers reported that uh, one individual had been struck by gunfire and was uh, laying in the, in the driveway here. Thursday morning, just before noon, Bentonville police responded to a call about a shooting at the 300 block of Rose Garden Lane. Uh, when our officers got here, uh, they saw the individual that was that was injured. They loaded him up, got him to the ambulance that was down the road. The man died from his injuries at the hospital. Corporal Adam McKinnis says police took a suspect into custody, a man that was a resident here. McKinnis says he shut himself inside the apartment for a while before he finally came out. Just some very quick negotiations, talking through the door with our uh, first responding officers, um, convincing that individual to come out. Uh, nothing that was prolonged. McKenna says police know the victim was inside the apartment at one point, but they're now piecing together the rest, blocking off the scene, taking photos, collecting evidence, and even towing a car from the driveway. In a super busy area, too. Like, we're right here by 14th Street. We talk to neighbors who say they've never seen anything like this. During the day, I mean... Really, most people are inside their houses or walking their dogs. Um, very calm neighborhood for the most part. Police haven't released the names of anyone involved in the shooting, but they do say they believe it's an isolated incident. Live in Bentonville, I'm Lydia Fielder, 4029 News.